comes our hero oh. once again. Hey, Does that mean we are done? Flee. Yeah. Take more than pirates to overrun Atlantis. Well, there's no point getting too cocky because they did a good job, those pirates. If it weren't for the Atlantean heroes, we'd have been in a bit of bother there. Another message from Poseidon Arkantos. His creatures help the pirates. Father, they stole the trident! What? Yes, it was stolen during the fighting. Camus. There could not be a clearer sign, Arkantos. We are losing Poseidon's favor. We must act. I will go to Troy as you ask. I'm going to get that trident back on the way. Zethos! Take supplies aboard and get the men together. We're setting sail. Can I come? No, I need you here in case they come back. Don't worry. This errand will not take long. Right then, yes, we do want to continue our journey on with the next scenario. Consequences. There's always consequences, isn't there? Perhaps setting out on this errand really was all that was needed to appease beside... Black Sails! Port side! And he leads us to Kamos, too. Archers, ready your bows! Prepare to come about! They're going to pay for insulting Poseidon and Atlantis. Right, so our first objective is to advance to the Classical Age and explore Lincoln. the island. Well, we've got our scout, so he can Fun. get to some exploring right about now. <coughs> Excuse me. And we have our army and some villagers to get us started. Right, so they can start with the food. Uh, actually, this dude here can start with building some houses, since we're already over our population limit. The scout is pretty fast, so hopefully he should survive any onslaught. But what did we have over here? Right, we can actually cast this thing, which will be good for getting animals. I mean, I'm not sure if you have to actually put it in a region where there is animals, or if they just sort of appear. I guess we'll figure that out shortly. But let's get some houses built, because we're not going to be progressing much further if we don't. Right, how do we advance? We need to build a temple. Okie dokie. Should we go for one more house for luck? For now? How many population does it do? 10. So they are put, uh, put us up to 55 population. At which point we should be able to start looking at building our temple, perhaps. Right then, I'll tell you what, we'll go for one more house. See how we've got the wood to do it. And one, two, three, four. I want to go for five villagers on food. And we'll start getting some wood now with the others. So we'll go for five on wood. Uh, right, this thing can build. Alright, uh, oh, we can't build any military yet. That's annoying. Okay, we'll have to go straight for a temple then. Which is what we're supposed to do anyway, so I guess it's not going to hurt. And we've got a nice bit of food and wood coming in. Always good to see. There are three resources. Food, wood and gold. If I remember you had stone as well, or rock in Age of Empires 2. And you also get favour, which you get from the temple which is used for certain units and whatnot. Ah, look, here we go, we're getting some animals. 150 food on those two deer, so we'll probably have to look at foraging those now. Right, 
We'll have half on uh, each one, I'd say. Yep, you can do some of the worship. And one, two, three, four, five. We go for fire. Let's go. No, I'm not going to advance just yet because I've got a feeling that the campaign will hold off on doing whatever it is it wants to do. Until we do advance. So I'm going to go for another five villagers. At least I hope I'm right on that, you know. And that we're not going to get a big army invading us now. Hello and welcome to the few of you that have... Uh, join me in the past few minutes. I don't expect many people on Twitch tonight because it was a last minute thing. But since the game has just come out I thought let's go ahead and see what it's about. See what sort of differences there are between this and the original release which has been a long time since I played it so um, it all looks pretty familiar to me from what I remember. So we've got villagers on wood, villagers on gold. And we can just sort of like lay back a bit at the minute, we don't need to rush ourselves too much. So let's Ah, oh, we can do Pegasus. He doesn't actually do much, I think he's like a scout of some kind. Uh which could be useful because our scout has died by the looks of things. So should we go ahead and build a Pegasus, see what he's like? And right, we're running out of food, are we? You go over there then. Why don't they kill these animals on their own? Here comes Pegasus. And fly over here. Right, now that we've got a nice income of food, wood and gold, I'm kind of thinking we should look at perhaps upgrading. I'm going to send a couple more people of our new villages over there and then we'll upgrade. Uh, right, who do we want? Ares or Hermes? Ares can give us the Cyclops. Hell's enemy unit to other enemy units. Uh, okay. These are some of the abilities that we get, I reckon. Or we could go for... And we also get Pestilence as our ability, which is target nearby enemy ability buildings, preventing them training any new units. I think we'll go for Ares. Sounds like the most interesting choice to me. We'll get some Cyclops uh, developed when we can. Right then. You go over here now. Uh, that's all good. Right, as soon as we've advanced, we'll start... Building some more... Well, starting to build some more military uh, outposts, because we have none. Right, so it looks like we found their village at last. And what have they got at the moment? So they've got a little army developing. I think I would say on the major side of things at the moment, but it's there. Got some watchtowers, that sounds like something we could start uh, thinking about putting in. We build watchtowers at this particular point. Uh, storehouse, house, granary. No, we can't. All we can do is advance. Maybe I should have advanced a little bit sooner then. Right, okay, start killing some more of these animals over here, please. And we are on 97% complete. Right, okay, uh, let's just take one of our wood gatherers and we'll begin by building a couple of sentry towers with you. And 
A military academy, please. Right then, if you could do... Yeah, we'll upgrade that first of all, even though we can't actually build one just yet. Right then, and you can build an archery range. Let's just Legend. take a quick detour down the beach here, see if there's any access points to our, to our little Esto. village. Malista. I don't think there is, but Malista. we'll just check that. Right, what's being built here? Etimi. Okay, right, what else? Um, ne. Go and build that there. Legend. Ne. Ne. Oh, Esto. there might be some access down here then. Yeah, there is. Esto. Carlos, Carlos, a couple of uh, enemy units over here to take care of. Right, we need to get some watchtowers over there, I would say. Uh, okay, we've got all three villages that are building, building over here. Right. And we're out of food again. Right, come over here. We'll have you. No, I don't want to do a farm. I'll do a granary. Okay, I've built it in the wrong place now. Well, that's the case. We can build the farms around it later. Or oh, in this game, do you not need to drop food off from farms to the granary? Was that only Age of Empires uh, 3? I can't remember. Whoa, we need to get these upgraded. Get the, mili uh, the villagers safe. Right, bring them over here. What are our army units still doing over here? I don't know if we're going to get these built in time, are we? Yeah, we should do it. Look, they're dead. Very well done. Have Right, let's see what we've got. Uh, villager, okay. Here comes our army, look. Right, we should hopefully with these few folk be able to take care of any invading forces that make their way over. Right, three idle villagers. How long have they been there? Hopefully not from the start of the game, but you never know. Right, then let's get some wood. We are running low on wood. Oh, this stupid headset just keeps killing the sound. It's really starting to annoy me a little bit. Uh, right, where are we? We've got our army here. Just check our objective. Train and army destroy the pirate town centre yet. That's what we expected. And we can train an elder cyclops now, which is nice. Prostagma. Prostagma. Is that a villager? Yeah. Prostagma. Take these two villagers, Prostagma. and they can. Uh, they were going to build something. What was it? I had them in my mind to build something, and now I can't think what it was. Okay, well they can start collecting wood then. Oh right, no, I know what it was. We just need one of them there. Houses. Right, our army's starting to build up a tad. Not a whole lot, it's got to be said, but a tad. Maybe we should build some more barracks, military academies, more archery ranges. Start getting a massive army, that'd be awesome, wouldn't it? You're out of food again. We'll clear off some of these other animals and then we'll look at building some farms, I'd say. Probably the best course of action right now. Uh, right then, you go and drop your food off. Because I know it must be getting heavy carrying that around. Right, build an army, we haven't got one of those yet. Our ogre should hopefully take care of all that stuff. Let's build another one, shall we? 
Vale, está. They're quite slow moving. 